Hey guys, um, so I have footage from the last couple days, but I will be deleting it because you know how I need room my phone to record, and um, I feel like this video is like more important. I just want to like document it, I guess, so that you know maybe it'll help me in the future, or maybe it'll help somebody else. I don't know, but uh, Elijah has been throwing up he was thrown up non-stop since Sunday night and uh I'll like put the date in somewhere around here because I can't really remember off the top of my head but uh we took him into the emergency room on Tuesday they didn't really diagnose him with anything they you know were concerned because he hadn't peed all day um he hasn't eaten since Saturday. It's now Friday. And he was fine Wednesday. He he had diarrhea still. But he, you know, was acting like himself and he's been drinking and I even, you know, I've been I've been nursing him so that he gets fluids and he's been keeping, you know, stuff down. Then all of a sudden he threw up this morning when he woke up and I'm really concerned. So I'm going to, um, I'm waiting for my mom and she's going to come and get us and we're going to go back to the emergency room. My poor baby, he's just not himself. Say hi. Yeah! You know, maybe he is himself, but I'm just really scared. And I saw a video about a little girl who passed away and... Like, you know, her mom was like, if I took her to the doctors this day, would this have happened? And I'm just really freaking out. So, we're taking him back to the emergency room. And, uh, hopefully they can do something to make him feel better. You know, tell me what's going on. There's no reason why he should be throwing up like that. Um, we did have his well visit which I did record, but had to delete. We had his well visit on the 10th. Um, and after the well visit is when it started, he got a hepatitis A shot. Um, I did not get the flu shot. Um, if you want to know why I didn't get the flu shot, I'll make a separate video on shots and vaccinations that I do and do not get. I really don't need anyone's opinion that I should have gotten it and that this wouldn't have happened if I did get it because I don't agree. Um, that's what's happening right now. We're um, about to go to the emergency room and I just wanted to get this on video. It's butter. Yeah. No. That's it. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> so uh as you can see he's feeling a little better um i just wanted to make a quick update before i uploaded the other part of the video um he's feeling a lot better real quick i don't know if i fully explained it in that first clip but he had been sick for like since sunday and I took him in to the emergency room on um, Tuesday. They pretty much said, you know, it sounds like he has like a stomach bug and, you know, because he was like throwing up nonstop. And he didn't have diarrhea yet until I think the morning I was going to take him to the emergency room. Hey. <laughs> so, you know, they were like, you know, it's a stomach bug, you know, it's just got to run its course, blah, blah, blah. You know, you need to get him to drink and, you know. The one, the doctor that was there, she was kind of like, you know, she was like, I don't want to, you know, have to, you know, give him the IV and stick him and, you know, upset him and blah, blah, blah. She was like, so try to get him to drink and, you know, you can go home and he should be fine. So I'm like, okay. So we went home that night. I think he threw up a little teeny bit. Then Wednesday, um, he had diarrhea and he, I think, threw up in the middle of the night he keeps he kept throwing up in the middle of the night the first night sunday night he threw up like all night like every couple hours so then so wednesday he was like okay then thursday like during the day he was like okay i think he had diarrhea then like thursday night when i took him to when he went to sleep 
he was he woke up like every couple hours screaming and crying like he was in pain so like I was like I don't know what to do like he wouldn't like he was his body was like stiff and so yeah so uh Thursday like Thursday night he was just you know um his body was like stiff and he was like kind of like in a position like and he didn't like in this weird position and he like didn't want to you know he didn't want to be touched and he didn't want to be moved and it was just you know he just wasn't himself like you could tell like he was in pain and I think he like had diarrhea in his sleep which he never I don't know like if I ever told you guys but he never pees or poops in his sleep ever like ever since he was born he's never peed or pooped in his sleep and I know like everybody says like all babies do he literally didn't so for him to be like diarrhea having diarrhea in his sleep and stuff like it was just weird and he hadn't peed I forgot Sunday Sunday um that night he was like that like he didn't get sick till Sunday night so then uh like the next day he didn't pee I think he peed once in the morning and then he didn't pee all day and then Tuesday he didn't pee so they were like you know you really need to take him to the emergency room so <laughs> so I took him and so anyway so he still wasn't peeing but he was like you know having diarrhea so I was like yeah, I need to take him into you know the emergency room again or I need to call his doctor again and see like what do they think I should do so Friday morning came and he was asleep and in the morning and he woke up throwing up and I'm like oh my god like I was freaking out so I'm like okay I think I might you know take him back then he threw up again and I was like that's it I'm taking him back so I take him back and they give him an IV you okay what's on your face cheese you want to wipe? So, uh, what was I saying? Oh, so they gave him an IV, and I was, like, really nervous about him getting the IV. It was so sad. And I'll insert a picture so you guys can see. It was really sad. And he did cry a little bit, but he was so, like, strong, and, like, I was so impressed by the way he was acting like he didn't I thought it was gonna be a lot worse he did you know fuss like a little bit but that first time he was fine they're like if he can keep something down you know you can go home if not then you know we'll see what we're gonna do then I, I think he drank like a teeny teeny bit like he took a little teeny sip of something and he threw up all over himself anyway so then the doctor comes up and he's like listen you know he just threw up again um I'm gonna send you to the other hospital is like the same kind of hospital, like same name, I think, except for it was, it's in a different like city and not city, like town, I guess city, whatever. It's like, um, it was like 15 minutes away and it, uh, it, it had a pediatric unit. The one that we were at didn't have the pediatric unit. So I was like, okay. And they were like, yeah, we're going to admit him. Like he's going to say it. He's going to say overnight. Sorry. He's like nursing. So, uh, and because he's still not drinking as much, I'll get to it. So anyway, so they're like, um, yeah, we're going to send him there and he's going to have to stay overnight. And I'm like, oh my God, like overnight. <laughs> so we ended up staying overnight and, uh, it was, you know, it wasn't bad. He didn't throw up the whole time we were there. He peed a couple times. He did have diarrhea and, um, you know, they had a bad IV on him all night. Um, uh, everything seemed fine. They just said, you know, he had, like, the stomach flu. Not the flu that you get the flu shot for, but, like, you know, just, like, the stomach bug, basically. And so he seemed okay. Then Friday when we came home, I mean, Saturday when we came home, he was fine. But then that night, he threw up again. And, uh, I think he might have had diarrhea that night, too. It seems like every day he has one episode of throwing up and like one or two episodes of diarrhea because this morning last night yesterday he which was what monday yesterday he threw up in a sunday night he threw up in the middle of the night again like around two yesterday he threw up like around this time which is like you know i'm trying to talk babe so he threw up then and then <laughs> and then he threw up um yeah, so he threw up yesterday. He didn't throw up today yet. He didn't throw up last night. So it seems like 
It seems like he throws up like once a day. And uh, he did have diarrhea this morning. So I don't know what's going on. I don't. But I have to make a follow-up appointment with his doctor. So we're going to see like what they say. But I just wanted to give that quick update. He seems fine now, you guys can see. And what would happen was he would he would uh be all happy and like hyper and you know, being himself and then all of a sudden he would shut down and like he didn't feel good and then he would like throw up or have diarrhea or, you know, just be like really lethargic. Like it was really scary the way he was acting. Oh. <laughs> And as you can see, like, I'm behind on everything. My Christmas tree is still up. Yep, and it's January 20th. And, um, yeah, we're going to put it down either tonight, like, sometime this week or weekend. I think G doesn't trust me to do it because it's, like, a newer tree and he wants it, you know, put back right how he took it out and everything. So, I don't know. But, yeah, I just wanted to give this quick update to you guys and let you guys know everything and that we're okay because I know I haven't vlogged since like the 7th I think and I still have to make those videos public I haven't even made them public like I don't know what I was waiting for I totally forgot but yeah so hopefully you know everything's okay and we'll start you know vlogging again and uh yeah, so I will talk to you guys later. Say bye. I, <laughs> I thought you wiped your mouth. You still got some there. What? Right there. Blow <laughs> them kisses.